okay so it's uh, done successfully and it's uh, updated this uh, vendor directory on the server right so now the time is to work on this uh, how we can get the env file so we have this env dot dot uh, env dot example file but we don't have dot env file because it's ignored by git no right so how to add this uh, file to run our project right so if I go here and give it a refresh, it's not going to work because we don't have any environment file, right? I'm going to add the environment file and to, then we will install the npm, then it's uh, get its database, execute the migrations, uh, uh, execute the test and stuff like that. So don't forget to check out other videos. So let me uh, now uh, go here, go to my project, right? Here after this, so uh, Composer installation. I want to add this uh, code, right? So I copied this. I assigned this name copy.env file, and this one is now uh, going to check that if this uh, file exists, right? And then it's going to copy this out.env file, right? Okay. So here, basically, it's going to check that env is exist. If not, it's going to uh, copy it in dot this uh, env dot example file and uh, add this to dot env file. Okay, so save this one and uh, let's uh, add this code again. I add this code, comment is added and push this code. It will push this code and our process will be uh, again. It will be started very soon. So just go here, click on this GitHub Actions, and yes, its uh, process is. Starting and if I click on this uh, fresh Laravel tab, so it will be uh, started in a few moments. So let's take eye on this. Okay, fresh Laravel tab, and 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 now it's not started yet. Yes, it's starting. Right. So let's click on this, and you can also see the logs here. So now it's going to uh, set up, uh, it's going to uh, get the latest code and it will install the dependencies and then it will uh, copy the env file, right? And uh, installing dependencies and after this it will uh, go to this copy.env file and yes, it's copy and syncing the file. So now it will install the composer, then, uh, then copy this file and in the later videos we will generate our uh, generate our key and stuff like that so i'm pausing this video and then i'm coming back 